immediately. There are enemies ahead. Press left shift to see the enemy's sight range. You can sneak into the transparent red areas by pressing C. Combat will start the moment you enter an opaque red zone and thus are spotted. I don't see anything yet. I'm gonna keep sneaking around though. Sneaky, sneaky. Whoa, 100 gold. Hype. Hype, 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 hype. All right, I see the dots on my map. Oh, there it is. So there's translucent and opaque areas. I don't think I'm gonna do that yet. Let's go get the waypoint first. That's a waypoint? Ain't the would get rid of any trace of the old source king. Wait, ancient statues of Baracus Rex are the waypoint? Oh, that's kind of creepy. Ooh. Bowstring. Yes. This statue must be a thousand years old. Oh, dude! It's a guy! The child has a small mirror in his hands. He holds it up at angles, inspecting his eyes, his chin, the crown of his head. He spots you, and his arms snap to his Oh, head. dude, is this... is this the... is this the, uh... Is this the undead mage? I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Tell him not to worry, he can trust you, human. Why? Tell him everyone's gotta stick to their own kind, especially now that the world's become so dangerous. Well, that sounds kind of racist. Let's just do say you won't harm him. Harm him. But are you a sorcerer? One of those guys that brings the bad void things here. Nod, you are. And by the looks like collar around his neck, so is he. The child looks at you straight on, unafraid, searching your face. He lifts his mirror to his nose, closes one eye, and looks at himself again. I don't see any source on you or me. I guess they're wrong. Or crazy. Tell him they may be well they may well be wrong and crazy. <laughs> Maybe you're right. At least they don't mind where anyone goes. They know we can't leave the island, and it's a lot nicer out here than outside. Ask him if his parents know where he is. They're gone now. Their majesties took them already. I guess now they're cured. And maybe they're waiting for me back at home. Say it isn't safe out here. Your ship was attacked by Void Woken not far off the shore. But you didn't die. Ask him why he doesn't seem scared. I guess I am, but it's just normal to be scared. Nowhere isn't scary. Yeah, it sounds like some parts of the world right now, unfortunately. Say you survived the Void Woken attack by the skin of your teeth, you should really find somewhere safer to go. There isn't anywhere safer. That's what I mean. You'll see. Uh oh. Uh. I wonder what that means. Can we go in the water? Let's see how far we can go in the water. Uh, actually, let's keep moving forward here. Save it. Oh, we can't do anything up here. Any clickables? Nope. All right, looks like we're heading down the beach. Man, I don't know what they did, but this looks so much more just realistic than the last one. I'm loving what they've done. Love what you've done with the place. It's nice. Uh, oh, we got all sorts of shells over here. Let's get all of them. What does a shell do? It adds, if this is anything, oh look, there's all sorts of different types of shells. Uh, if this is anything like the original. Void Woken. Those are the same beasts that sank our ship. Damn, they made it to shore. Ooh. Cool. Alright, before we go down this path, let's get these Void Woken. Life is a beach. Well said. Vampiric hunger? Oh, that sounds fun. Uh, let's buff up. Actually, I'm gonna save my AP. I'm gonna let them run to me. You. I know you. What? Um. 
Dude, I'm really, really digging that apparently effects are no longer a chance. Like, since they don't have armor, every single knockdown attack we use against them will always work. That is gonna add a whole different level of strategy to this game. Because we can have guaranteed effects if we do it properly. Hmm. Damn it. Man, he only did two points of damage, but I think that's about how much he healed. My lord, man. Oh, that's not what we needed. Dude, is this gonna like refill his health? Oh. Está no bueno. No bueno, amigo. Let's knock him down again. Good, I think we can get him next turn. Remember to use Encourage. Yeah. It's, it's only one AP, right? Yeah, I should probably be doing that at the beginning of fights. We'll, we'll start making a habit of using Encourage. Let's actually uh, do this. I thought these bloody collars were supposed to keep those things at bay. Uh, you guys over here. There we go. Okay. Great. Let's rest. Not that I needed to. All right, what? Oh, you gained a level! Press I to enhance your stats and abilities. Okay, so how does this work? Um, let's raise my wits, because I want to be super... Oh, God. Did I really just put two points into there? Oh, wow. And there's no going back, is there? All right, 13 wits it is! Um, let's see. What else can we do? Let's add a point in single-handed. Oh. Ability check what characters can do and how well they do it. Um, okay. I want to do a single-handed to start with. Yeah. Good. Let's start with a hit of persuasion. Because this guy is probably also going to be our smooth talker. Wait a second, there's no crafting in this game? There's no crafting abilities. Interesting. Oh, hit G? Well, I, well, I meant, what I meant to say is there's no crafting abilities. Yeah. Um, that's what I should have said. There's no crafting and blacksmithing anymore. Yeah. I'm sorry. I should have been more careful how I said that. There's clearly, definitely crafting in the game. And in fact... Round and eaten by a void woken. I wonder what you done. <laughs> um, something that is pretty interesting is, uh, Bikeman yesterday told me that not only is there crafting in this game, but apparently we can craft spells later that, uh... Do all sorts of cool stuff. So, yeah, really looking forward to that. Defensive talents are gone too, yeah. Yeah. They made a lot of big changes to this. Waypoint travel. Fort Joy Beach. Okay, cool. There's that. I wonder if there's going to be any kind of banking system. I hope so. Anything over here? Okay. More shells and... Hey, the Red Prince! Grab all these.
I like Michelle's. All right, dude. What's up? You spot a strange lizard gazing over the water with a steady, malcontent stare. His skin is of a bright blood red color. Could he be? Yes, you recognize him from the ship. It would seem you're not the only one who survived the tentacles of the deep. Greet him heartily and say that you're glad to see he survived the shipwreck. Smirk and tell him his slave has come to report for duty. The lizard turns about with the graceful ease of a dancer or a duelist. You lock eyes with his two smoldering embers that sizzle your very soul. Hey, Lun. Continue. And a dutiful servant you are too. The chances are I wouldn't have survived that shipwreck had you not returned to the aid of your master down that dreadful hole. Continue. You have my gratitude. Cool. Hand over heart, he salutes you with a bob of the head. More than a nod, though less than a bow. Tell him you are glad to be of help doesn't do to stand idly when people are in danger. Yes, I'm sure you've all the makings of a hero and all that, but let's not get carried away, shall we? Nevertheless, one good turn does deserve another, so as far as the whole slave business is concerned, let's just forget about it. You may as well have your freedom. Now then, if there's nothing further... What are you doing next? If you really must know, I haven't quite decided yet. I have a frightful amount of things on my mind, hence my standing here contemplating the waves. He sighs dramatically. <laughs> Tell me, what do you see when you cast your glance over this ocean? Uh, memories. Childhood days spent in the sun. Memories. Quite so. He looks out over the water once more, and so do you. A few tranquil moments pass as the waves lap against your thoughts. As for myself, when I consider this vast expanse before us, I see an empire. I see continents dotted with mighty cities. And shimmering along the soft curve of the sea's horizon, I picture the palaces that formed my paradise. Lost. Wow. Um, okay. What do you mean by lost, exactly? What do you mean, what do I mean? I mean just what I say. I had a very actual empire that I lost. Hmm. Suddenly, having all the air of being deeply offended, he stares at you with utter incredulity. Incredulity. Well, don't just stand there gawking like an ape at an abacus. Or do you really need to tell me you don't know who I am? Tell him you've never heard of an abacus that can tell people who they are. <laughs> well, more's the damn pity, isn't it? For I am the Red Prince, the All Conqueror, the World Tamer, the Spouse of the Sun. Of course you know me. Oh, of course. There's a brief moment's pause, during which his grandiloquent pose deflates ever so slightly. That said, I suppose I must own up to the fact that I find myself rather in between all-conquering and world-taming opportunities at the moment. Hmm. The grandeur that is my fate has a hit a bit of a snag. But never you worry. For the throne I was destined, and my throne I shall have. Invite him to travel with you. Maybe you can help him win back his throne. Truly. A kind offer indeed. And you've already proven to be trustworthy enough. You came back for the others on that ship after all. Fine. I accept. Awesome. Uh, you okay? Oh. On one condition. For reasons I'll not disclose right now, it is imperative that I should meet with a dreamer. One of the mystics of my kind. Okay. I've reason to believe one of them may be present on this island. Promise me we'll look for him, and I'll extend you the blessing of my company. Sure. Jolly good. So, now that that's settled, first things first. Even if you are as versed in the art of eloquence as I am, that our swords will be doing a lot of the talking from here on out goes without saying. As a born fighter, I prefer the perfection of the blade myself. But I'm well acquainted with the secrets of magic and, yes, even subterfuge. What say you? What? We get to pick what he is? Oh, dude. 
Let's see if he'll be our magic guy. What's up, Frice? <laughs> um. Oh, oh, no, she's fine, guys. She she yelled up she was fine. Thank you, though. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, no, she's good. She's good. Trust me, if she needs help, she will let me know. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm already a fighter. So, um, let's do magic. Wizardry is embedded in my nature as deeply Damn, as look at this. to breathe and drink and mate. The dominion over fire suits me best, truth be told, but there is no school of magic I cannot master. I kind of want to make him my cleric. But he did mention fire, so an elemental powerhouse could be fun. Did you want me to order you lunch? That'd be great. What do you want? Regular. Wait. So yeah, I'm sure. Fingers, Perfect. Uh, chicken and a sub today would be great. And I'll split it with, with Con. Thanks, babe. Um. The only thing I'm a little bit worried about is if I don't make him a healer. I wonder how long it's going to be until we get one. Uh, uh, I do. I do like the lizard warrior idea, though. What is conjurer? Oh, that's summons. Yeah. We're gonna do wizard. Very well. Onwards then to the Red Prince Dunn. And gives you a smile that wavers ever so delicately between courtesy and contempt. Now, as you're away, you'll be traveling with a prince. Proper forms of address include your majesty, your royal highness, or, or if you're feeling particularly frivolous, my lord. My lord. As your luck would have it, I seem to be fresh out of luggage, so you won't be required to carry my belongings. Oh, great. You know who this guy reminds me of? Lucifer on the recent show Lucifer this guy reminds me of that actor and I love it of course there are other forms of protocol to bear in mind but I'll see to it you'll pick up the rest as we go so without further ado let us be off fantastic okay you've learned a new skill press K to open your skills panel Pull your party portrait up to unchain them, breaking the chain that stops them from following the party. Wait, what? Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, that's chained. That's unchained. That's chained. Okay, cool. It just links them together. All right. Okay. This is your skill screen. If you want to learn more skills, you need to find it by skill book. Skills belong to various categories of skill schools to be able to. Okay, you need to find some building points though. Okay, so we have an empty spot we can do. Cool. Um, okay, what about you? Tension increases as more crimes are committed and is naturally higher in certain areas. As tension rises, others are less likely to forgive your indiscretions. Ooh. Okay. Alright, so you are two pyrokinetic and one geomancer. Interesting. All right, all right. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Okay. Ooh, there's our combat log. Let's actually keep that right. Pixel perfect. Boop. Okay. Okay. So let's save it. And let's keep moving, man. We got a bro now. We got a bro! Bro hype. Alright, so. Do we have an idea about where we're actually supposed to go? We're supposed to go south. So we're supposed to go down right now. So let's go... Ooh, oh, mushrooms. These are healing mushrooms. If they're like, do we, do we have any empty bottles? Oh, I don't think we do. Um, crafting, 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 crafting. 
Hmm. Yeah, we don't. Ingredients. Oh, look at that. Empty potion bottle. And you. Yes. Okay. So now we, we I guess we already have that recipe. Yeah, there it is. Okay, cool. Great. Great. Um... Are you dual wielding wands? Oh shit, look at that. Poison wands, damn. Cool. Alright. Let's keep poking around over here. Black cat. Hello, kitty. Oh, where? Oh, you. The cat's eyes are clouded and grey, but it stares at you with acute intensity. Its eyes clear, and it shakes its head, confused. Now let's go to our pet pal guy. The cat's eyes are clouded and gray, but it stares at you with acute intensity. Hmm. What? How did I get... Hey, stop following me. Are you feeling okay? Huh? Yeah, fine. I'm fine. I just... I'm not sure. It's all a little foggy. Where'd you come from? The cat opens his mouth as if to speak. But his eyes lose focus, and with a jerk, he turns away from you. The cat's eyes are... What's going on? Hmm... That's a little What's this? weird. I found something. Ooh... I need a shovel. Oh! Apparently lizards can just one must put in dig due effort if one is to reap the proper reward. Freshly buried corpse? Oh, dude. Um Boom. Okay, let's try. Oh my god, look at that. Dude, this... Whoops. And this. Fun. And Dragon Breath. Can I not hit Ko? Okay, there we go. Yo, this guy is strong as shit. I just did fire damage? Freshly buried corpse was hit for three fire damage by a surface? The cat's eyes are cl- Hmm. Oh, I didn't even have anything. Here lies a nameless inmate. May he find the peace denied him in life in the Hall of Echoes. Hmm. Well, that was random and pretty cool. Okay. Oh, let's rest. Boop. Perfect. All right, nothing else over here. Looks like we can maybe loop around and go up here. Ooh, a shovel. Let's go ahead and bring this stuff. Oh, well, no, you don't. That's fine. Skull. Let's eat the raw meat. Okay, cow meat. Hmm. Ah, nice and warm. Okay, nothing here. Let's go over on this side. We leave little water footprints. Nice. 
Okay, looking good there. Whoa. What? Keep an eye out for secret passages. Revelin is full of hidden levers, pressure plates, and mysterious latches. Try walking through the hanging vines. Oh, cool. All right. I wonder where this leads. It's fame. Let's wait a second before we say hi to him. Also, the cat's following me now. Who's this? Ugh. Oh, pretty. Uh oh. Corpse of an elf. Hmm. I'll have to look at that later. I right, was talking to Fane, see what he's up to. What's up, mate? As the alcove opens up, you see the same skeleton that you met on the boat before it sank. He's still not wearing his mask. Oh yeah, I need to use an item per fight. Thank you for reminding me. You're absolutely right. He's leaning over a corpse, prodding and pulling at the skin of his face. Bugger. Bugger. How on earth am I supposed to Oh. Perhaps Skeletal fingers reached down and gripped the skin of the dead man's face, pulling sharply upwards. After a few more tugs at the man's cheeks, the skeleton relents, letting the head drop to the ground with a damp thud. Damnation. That stuck fast. I wonder, does the beard act as some form of anchor? Cough politely. Ah! No! Stay back! Don't... Oh, it's you. I must admit, I'm surprised. Perhaps you're more buoyant than I suspected. Nod towards the corpse. Anything valuable there? Oh, yes. An exceptionally common, but exceptionally valuable commodity. A face. A face that seems rather stubbornly attached to his skull. What a rude face, right? I would normally employ a tool to delicately, but viciously, rip the face from the body. I could then craft a mask to hide my bone, but as I lack such a tool... The skeleton grabs the corpse by the cheeks and pulls hard, grunting in frustration as the body's skin holds firm. Why does he need to make a mask? Well, we know the answer to this, but... Because my own was stolen from me! And the idea of being chased across Rivalon by every idiot with a torch does not appeal! <laughs> oh! Get away! Monster! Hide the children! Oh. You are simple beasts. And you simply do not like my... Well, not my kind, but those that look like me. So, if I am to traverse this land, I will need a mask to disguise my features. Tell me wash up on the shores of Fort Joy. This is a prison. He's not traversing anything. Oh, don't be ridiculous. I have important things to do on Reaper's Coast. I cannot simply sit about waiting for the rest of you to die so I may continue my business in peace. No. I may be an eternal, but my patience has its limits. Indeed. I may be the only eternal. My people seem rather... absent. At least from this realm. As for the others... well... There is an excavation site at the Black Pits oil fields. Perhaps there I'll find my answer. This sounds horribly interesting. What is an eternal? A cult? Hardly. We were a race that existed before the idea of race was needed. We were all one. I could ask you to imagine an eternal as a creature of incredible intelligence and skill. But I fear the limits of your imagination would not do us justice. Rude! We studied the mysteries of the universe. We created works of great art. We... We disappeared. <laughs> but I will find them. Wherever they are, I will find them. We will have our world again. Why are you still here? Well, that hardly seems relevant. But if you must know, I was inconvenienced for a time. Several centuries, in fact. Or perhaps millennia. One tends to lose track. I was sealed in a tomb for daring to be curious about the world. It seems our king did not agree that the universe should be explored to its full potential. 
Hmm. Perhaps I should thank him. It seems I was spared whatever happened to the others. I wonder if flowers would be appropriate. Where are your people? In some other realm? Ah, well, that is the curious thing. They are clearly absent from this world, and yet they are everywhere. What? Every one of your races resembles them in some manner. And the statues you have built to your gods look remarkably familiar. Perhaps my people have ascended to some new realm. Or perhaps your gods are merely a folk memory. Whoa. Regardless, they are not here. But I will find them. Wherever they are, I will find them. We need you as a companion. I suppose. Circumstances being what they are, it could be advantageous. You seem more at ease in this world than I. A guide would certainly be useful. Could work well for both of you. Excellent. While we are conversing, perhaps you notice that I am rather skilled. Oh. In, of course, the arcane arts are my little um. speciality. But being a brilliant wizard does not mean I cannot handle blade or bow. So, which do you require for this enterprise of yours? Did you see Subnautica released a pet update? Yes, I did, Bikeman. Dude, I cannot wait to uh, to check out Subnautica when it comes out. Um, I think we could either do Skeletal Healer, which is kind of amazing. I think that's hilarious. Or we could make him a Necromancer, which I think would also make a lot of sense. Um, I kind of want to make him our healer, though, because that's kind of hilarious. I think I think undead cleric is just kind of perfect. It's just it's exactly like total like totally evil just said I love the heresy of it all. Um, 